The following is a presentation of the Eagles Sports Network. Uh, first off, we have Irish Miles, a defender, coming in as a transfer. Uh, was at UT San Antonio, originally from South Carolina. She'll be coming in uh, as an outside back for us. Uh, very athletic um, and actually will have four years of eligibility to play with us. So we're excited to get her in. Um, type of player that we're looking for in that position, but excited um, as, as far as a transfer coming in, having one year experience at that level. Next we have Iris Pal's daughter, another defender from Iceland. She's coming in as a freshman, uh, center back, played at a very high level in Iceland. Um, and I, I expect her to come in and make an immediate impact for us um, at the center back position. Kendall Garber, from Pennsylvania coming in as a freshman again another center back uh, very very athletic and uh, came on a visit and really really impressed overall with her ability on the ball very good in the air decision making so again I just feel like she's a player that will come in and bolster that defensive line another player we have uh, Malia Kim Malia is a midfielder she's transferring in um, we were looking at her originally, um, but didn't didn't work out at the time. So we've got Malia coming in now as a midfield player. A, a true kind of eight or a 10, can get on the ball, uh, very, very athletic, and can get around the field. So excited to get her in. We've got a forward coming in in Krista Nielsen from Iceland. Uh, a number nine center forward but can play in the 10 position as well. Uh, played at the highest level in Iceland and contributed a lot to our team. So we're very fortunate, very lucky to get her into Carson Newman. I expect her to come in and make an immediate impact for us. Another mid, uh, forward we have is Cam Giles. Cam comes in from UT Chattanooga. Played, um, played her four years at Chattanooga and fortunate enough to be able to get her in to do her graduate work. I coached Cam seven, six or seven years ago, I suppose it is now, at the Tennessee ODP level. So I'm very um, aware of her and we recruited her out of, out of high school and she chose to, to, to go division one and play at, at UT Chattanooga. So another player that's gonna come in and do very, very well for us. Another forward we've got on the transfer portal is uh, Alicia Teske. She's coming in from Emmanuel College. Uh, played uh, a year there and is actually uh, friends with Irish Miles, who's coming in as well. So uh, very, very athletic. I believe she's 5'10", 5'11". Can play on either wing in the seven or 11 position. Um, like I said, very very fast, very athletic. We're excited to see her coming in. I think she'll she'll really improve us overall. I don't want to say it's the it's the kind of holdover from COVID. We had a few players that were able to take that fifth year and and so on. But um, a few players have transferred out, and um, one of our players, very excited for her, got the opportunity to go back to Switzerland and play pro. Um, so. It was um, not planned originally last year when we had we had done the, the, the class that came in last year. So we had to jump on it pretty quickly and then try and bring in uh, as many as we could because looking at next year now, we only have three players from this class that will be graduating. So we're kind of set now for the next couple of years, um, all going well. But yeah, we, we had to move pretty quickly on it. Um, we availed of the transfer portal and this year was quite quite an oddity in the transfer portal because there was a, a transfer window almost so um, I think we brought in maybe five transfers overall um, and then the rest five or six and then the rest in in, uh, in freshmen so I think we have a really good mix good experience coming in and then some exciting freshmen coming in